this neighborhood means a lot to us, and we believe that this neighborhood and this project will mean a lot to this community um, once it's developed and built out. People move here to Manatee County for a number of reasons, not the least of which is the natural beauty, and we're here to make sure that that doesn't change on this particular property. Aqua by the Bay sits on a very special stretch of land. Um, it's really at the center of, of the design of the entire project. Um, this project will be focused on preservation, uh, vibrant quality of life, as well as the revitalization of West Bradenton. Historically, the property has been used for agriculture. Uh, it was leased by Manti Fruit Company when Manti Fruit Company was the uh, nation's leader in gladiolus farming and distribution. It then changed hands to become uh, a tomato farm and most recently over the course of the last 10 years or so has been used for cattle ranching activities. This project also has two fully permitted uh, projects that come with it as well. One is on parcel F, which will be about the where, area where we park uh, later on this morning. That was approved about 10 years ago or so for 258 multifamily units. And then most recently, a few years ago, Aqua One, which is the project that abuts or is adjacent to Legends Bay, was approved for 200 single family units. But we wanna talk about the overall project, uh, the parent parcel. And we think that this would be a real boon to the uh, West Bradenton. There's been a lot of focus and development on East County with Lake of Ranch. They've done a fabulous job, tremendously master plan community. Uh, there's been a lot of focus on the growth north of the river, uh, but West Bradenton has been somewhat left behind. And we think that this will provide a foothold for reinvestment into that side of town.